Okay, so afternoon guys, hope everyone's having a fantastic day out there today. I've actually got a day off, thank God at last. Welcome to another episode of The Viking Beard with me, Matt. And as you probably know if you watched any of my other videos on my channel whatsoever, I'm trying to grow myself a big, thick, dense, epic Viking style beard. And on the videos, I'm sourcing various different products. Products are getting sent through to me. Stuff for my beard, stuff for my skin, stuff for my hair, and all sorts of bits and pieces. Because I want to make myself look good, feel good, smell good. Stuff that nourishes my beard and nourishes my skin and good for my hair and stuff. And what I'm priding myself on, on this channel, that I'm not actually affiliated to any of these companies whatsoever, it is my own opinion and it's my own honest opinion. I am not here blowing smoke rings up any companies wherever. So that is what you get from this channel. Now if you are looking for videos with spangly music and stuff going off on screen and everything, you're not going to get that here because A, I don't know what I'm doing and how to do that so it doesn't matter. And you're not really interested in that anyway. You just want to know about the products, what I think of them. So. That is what I'm doing on my channel here. So, what I do with all the reviews that I do is I have a look at the packaging, I have a look at the product itself, the ingredients, the price point of it, what I think of the products. Afterwards then scoring it out of 10. Zero being, I'm never gonna touch it again. 10 being absolutely phenomenal, I'm never gonna stop using it. And five in the middle going, hey, it's kind of all right. So, yeah. So, like I say, not affiliated to any of these companies whatsoever. Just have a quick swig before we get started. Ah, so as you probably know, if you've seen one of my other videos, that I had some beard oil sent through from a company called The Pure Collection in Regent Street in London. Now, they've been very kind enough to send something else for me to have a look at, try and review. For my skin, because I need the help that I all the help that I can get, and they thought I might like it, so I'm going to give it an honest review. So this is from the Pure Collection London or the PureCollection.com, and this is what they have sent through me. We're going to look at the packaging to start with, then the products and everything afterwards. So with the Pure Collection, they're priding themselves on all natural. 100% certified and organic stuff okay so no chemicals no nasty stuff in it which is why this company kind of has one of those top end sort of price point sort of things they're a luxury item so but we all know luxury items and expensive stuff doesn't mean it's actually fantastic if you go out and you buy yourself a Lamborghini you can still drive 30 mile, only drive 30 miles an hour in a 30 mile an hour zone so just because it's way up there on price it doesn't mean that it's any good and going to be any different to anything else but we shall have a look and what they've sent me through is some argan oil which has got gold flakes in it so box itself like with pretty much most of the stuff in the pure collection it's kind of got that sort of chic looking elegant top end sort of box on it gold on the matte black and it's cardboard opening up the drawer inside we have the argan oil itself so pop that down on there you can see that in there looks nice against the dark matte black you can see all the gold flakes whizzing around in there and we shall take it out and have a look there we don't need the box so this is it I don't know whether you can see all the little gold flakes yeah it's better view whizzing around and this is argan oil now this the actual jar itself it's glass which is nice it's got the logo on the front it's a pipette style applicator on the top with the gold as well which looks nice on it and this would look very nice if I had at some point in my life to have some sort of penthouse luxury London suite or somewhere overlooking the Riviera or wherever would look very very nice on the shelf. I live by the seaside it's not the Riviera but hey 
but it looks a very nice product and I like the way it's well made, well presented in the box that it comes in and everything, very high end looking stuff. So like I said, this is argan oil. Now this is first pressed 100% organic argan oil, which has come from Morocco. And inside the gold itself, the flakes in there are 22 karat gold flakes. And we'll talk about the gold very soon in it and why companies are starting to use gold and everything else. And I have been using this, so this is just not an unboxing. Now what I'm going to do with this video, which is the first time I've ever done this with any of my reviews, this is going to be a two-part because I've been using it for about three days. But over the course of this month till the end of September, I'm going to then come back and kind of almost re-review it because a lot of products take time to work and everything else like that. And there's no point in me just doing a review and going, well, it doesn't do that. It doesn't do that because obviously it needs time to work. So argan oil can be used for lots and lots and lots of different things from hair, skin, nails. So we'll go through a few of those. Now you can use it for acne. When I was a kid, I had a sort of like a few problems with acne on one side of my face and it allegedly kind of helps with kind of clearing it up and everything else. It helps with stretch marks if you're pregnant, just had a baby and stuff like that, lost weight or whatever. If you've got brittle nails, it apparently helps to make them a lot softer. If you've got cold, dry, chapped lips, again, it's supposed to hydrate them, plump it and if it helps your face with healing and dry skin apparently minimizes kind of fine lines and stuff like that and improves tone um, tightness of the skin and everything else like that and hydrates the skin so a lot of good stuff now i have put some of this on this morning and I'm using it twice a day, once in the morning when I get up, once again in the evening before I go to bed. What I'm finding with this, it does soak in at the skin very, very quickly. With the job that I do, my skin does have a tendency of drying out and I'm noticing with it that it does feel my, make my skin feel softer. It is helping to hydrate my skin and it feels a bit more supple than it was and and softer as well as far as fine lines i think i'm well past the whole fine lines thing i think i need cement for that and some sort of i don't know what but i need i need more than argan oil that's going to sort me out make me look youthful again and i think this whole youthful thing and making yourself look younger is kind of more of a mental thing than it is a physical thing you see some of these programs on TV, especially nowadays with people that go out and have a lot, I'm talking a lot of cosmetic surgery done to the point that they look absolutely ridiculous. So it's nice rather than going down that cosmetic route, and don't get me wrong, I have no problems at all with anybody getting whatever cosmetic surgery they want done. It's your own life, do what you like. If you've got scars and disfigurations, of course it's fine to get cosmetic surgeries and stuff. But the people going out getting cosmetic surgery to make themselves look younger, I think you can't really stop aging. We're not going to live forever. We're not here forever. Embrace what's up in here and stuff that you can do outside and everything else as opposed to worrying about what you look like because there is going to come a point if you do too much of these cosmetic procedures you're going to look very silly. So it's nice to kind of find products that help not necessarily slow it down, but kind of help your skin and hair and everything else like that. Because argan oil you can use, as you probably know, for your hair. Help, kind of help helps keep it hydrated and gives it a bit of a shine and everything. Now with the gold that's in there, there is a reason. Yeah, it's a bit of fun. It looks almost, to me, reminiscent of when I was young, when my parents used to have one of those original what they called oil lamps and everything with the rocket shapes and everything back in the 70s and gold though does have healing properties allegedly that it increases elasticity in your skin it helps promote um, the effects of aging 
and it slows down allegedly collagen depletion as well. Now obviously that isn't going to work and with all the stuff from Argan oils in three days. So I'm going to be giving this another review or at least a catch up in a month's time to kind of say whether I think it's worked, whether it's worth it or anything else like this. So it's good for what I've had it done or used it for so far. Skin feels softer, more hydrated, not suffering from dry flaky skin or anything like that. So in that respect, yes, it is working. Now the price point on this. Now, as you probably know, the Pure Collection London is one of your high-end luxury things. And with this, obviously, you, you pay the price for it. So on a 10 mil of this, you are paying nine pounds. On a 100 mil of this, you're paying 45 pounds. Now, is that a lot of money? If it works, no, not really, because obviously you're not gonna use a whole bottle in a week. It comes out using one, the pipette, obviously, and I do like the fact that it has a pipette on it because obviously you can control it rather than just splashing it everywhere and throwing it everywhere. So I think 45 pound for a bottle that size, 100 mils, gonna last you bloody ages. Looks nice on the shelf. You can use it obviously male or female, and it's gonna be one of those sort of Things that people look when they go into your bathroom or wherever and see this and go, oh, what's that? And a bit of a talking point. And I, I think, hopefully, it's going to be worth it, okay? Because like I say, I'm going to give this around about a month to try out so I can give you my full results at the end of it. But so far, it's a very nice product. I do like it. I like the packaging on it. So at the moment, because of how I've used it, I'm going to score this at... A nine. Now the reason I'm scoring it at a nine is because if it I do look fantastic in a month's time and you come back to YouTube and go, is that the same bloke that was doing it before? Hey? God he looks younger, then that's gonna get like ten ten plus 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 plus. But if it comes back and it's not really done anything apart from hydrating, softening, and kind of made myself feel um make my skin feel a bit sort of tighter then I'm going to score it accordingly. So I'm going to score it twice at the moment. Yeah, it's fine. It's a great product. Love using it and everything else like that. And at the end, I will change the score accordingly. Keep it the same depending on how I feel on it. So this is the Pure Collection. Excuse me. 100% pure organic natural argan oil with 22 karat gold flakes in it. I'm going to put links down below there for the Pure Collection London and the social media sites and everything else so you can please go and check them out. I have done a lot of research on argan oil and using gold since this came through in the post and so I am watching it with one eye open to see what it actually does and what happens at the end of it. So it would be kind of unfair to score it after three days and give it a zero because it's not done anything whatsoever apart from hydration. So I want to give this one time. So I will come back to this and I'll let you guys know as soon as I do, which will be around about the end of the month. So yeah. Now, I hope you guys are having a fantastic day out there today. Please feel free to subscribe, like, and comment down below. I'm doing this 100% honestly, and in my opinion. Should anybody have any comments, please feel free. Thank you guys for watching another video. I hope you have a fantastic day. I will be back on recording another review very very soon but thank you keep loving each other keep on growing those beards take care of each other out there and i look forward to speaking to you soon on another episode of the viking beard so thank you guys speak soon